for centuries, traditional sculptors have used their hands and tangible tools to shape pieces out of materials like clay, rock, metal or putty. However, in this age of rapidly evolving technology, sculpting, like many other arts, has taken a new tech-savvy direction. My name is Varuna Valigamage. I'm the managing director for Mancave Toys Private Limited. And I work as a, a freelance digital sculptor for Quantum Mechanics, uh, California. My uh, job is I'm uh, sculpting portraits. And uh, when the companies need uh, photos and uh, prototypes of the uh, action figures, and when they need uh, human portraits, I do those. So basically 3D sculpting is like, uh, it's a digital form and uh, my tool is ZBrush. I use ZBrush for digital sculpting. And when a company or a private collector asks me to do a certain sculpture, what I do is I watch movies and for the uh, certain uh, character or watch their TV shows or talk shows and reference, we do reference interest. So the knowledge of the character should be there because you have to know each and every uh, inch of his face and every mole he has, every pimple he might have. If the client approves of the sculpture, Warner then uses 3D printing to bring various beloved characters from Pennywise the Clown to Game of Thrones Tyrion to life. He recently became the first Sri Lankan to have a sculpture featured at the prestigious San Diego Comic Con. I started to learn uh, 3D and it was like 2014 I think I uh, first started to learn myself and it was basically I was learning through the online tutorials and stuff. What started out as a hobby later turned into a career. Waruna lost his job but got an unexpected commission from an American collector who had seen and admired his work. I knew that how to do the sculpting, that's the only thing that I knew. So what I uh, told him is, I can do the sculpture but in the meantime I will learn what is the process of 3D uh, printing. One of my uh, favorite projects uh, like the Patriot project I did because still I remember I, I'm going to watch that movie with my father. That was the very first movie I watched in a uh, theater and uh, Mel Gibson is my favorite uh, actor. So getting that commission to be done by myself was the best thing which happened to me because it was like being with him all the time. So and the memory that I had with my father going to the movie, so it was like childhood coming back again. Having tasted international success, Warren now hopes to open doors for more talent in Sri Lanka itself. You know, when it comes to tailoring, painting, everything is done in internationally. So what I am trying to do is to get those done in Sri Lanka and, you know, to one day to make a licensed figure under my company name, that would be my goal.